six cool and easy two by two piston doors for MCPE and bedrock. Stay tuned for all six tutorials, quick time. Hey there guys, Skippy here from Skippy6 Gaming. Guys, coming to you, I'm liking these six of, so we're gonna do six two by two piston doors that will work for Bedrock, MCPE, Windows 10 Switch, all that jazz. We're gonna do them, they're nice and easy, quick tutorials. If I go too fast, just, just pause it, bro, just pause it. And if you wanna see the next door, just click forward a little bit. I'm gonna go from left to right. They're all very easy and super cool. Guys, for this one here, let's go for 391 likes. If you're one of those dudes, don't forget to hit me up below. So yeah, follow me on Twitter, guys. Twitter is key to success and it will help you bring joy to your world. So uh, as you can see, this is gonna be the first one. Nice piston door, both sides with tr pressure plates. So uh, this one here is actually a cool little spiral door that's gonna be a pretty quick little spiral. Back and forth, back and forth. You can have a lever if you want. This one here is a two by two sand door. It doesn't break the sand and it works completely perfect and nice, nice like that. This one here is another spiral. It's very simple with a weird lever placement, but as you can see, two by two spiral, almost one wide. It's kind of one wide. Right here we have a Jeb door. This is something that you don't get on MCP and Bedrock too much, but you could see works a little bit differently, but it does, I call it a Jeb door, but let me, let me rephrase that. It's a flush door because it kind of stays flush with the wall and matches. And last but not least, guys, this is kind of, I don't know, it's pretty easy, this door. Look. Oh, what happened? So that happens once every thousand, but... I think I had it in the wrong cycle. And there you go, easy peasy. So, like I said, guys, we're gonna start with door number one down here. If you wanna fast forward, fast forward. We're only at two minutes, and I have the ingredients list already made on each one. So for this simple two by two, we're gonna need four sticky ickies. We're gonna need two redstone torches, 12 redstone dust, four pressure plates, four blocks for the door, and two other blocks. So let's go over here. We're gonna go over here. Let's just go right behind it. Grab your other blocks. These other blocks are a key to success, right? Pretty much here and here. Uh, the way that you know where they are where they are, is because the pistons open in front of them. So what we're gonna do here is actually cut this guy out. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. So once we've done this, the way that you get on this guy is click this guy out like this. Click this guy out like this, redstone torch. Redstone torch looks good. Center two on each side. Do this, do this, ding, ding. Dust is gonna go here, here, all the way across like this. This guy, this guy, this guy. Take this guy here, dust, dust. That's where you're gonna put your pressure plates. Right here, right here, right here, right here. Grab your sticky, icky, icky pistons and put the piston right here and right here. We're gonna want the top one to work too, don't worry. I'll hook you up. Guess that guy in there. One more sticky piston on top with a redstone dust back here and a redstone dust back here. So is there something down there? And there you go, they stay closed. Your door is now going to be right here and right here. So uh, we have our first piston door right here. Make sure you're gonna wanna, you're gonna wanna fill up the floor so you don't fall in and uh, off to the next door. And now we're gonna do this beautiful little spiral jobber right here. Remember how cool it is? Yeah, awesome, awesome, awesome. So let's get the things we need. They're gonna be right in here. You're gonna need four blocks for the door, 12 other blocks. Uh, you're gonna need five redstone torches, four sticky ickies, one button or a lever. I'll show you how to put both of them on. One redstone repeater and seven redstone dust. Start this guy off with a nine wide hole in the ground. Yeah, nine wide. It's gonna be three deep. A little deeper than I wanted to go and what we're gonna do is start with the second from the top one on the end once we've done this we're gonna carry this guy over by skipping one it's gonna be over here one two three once these guys have done in we're gonna go ahead and skip one there looks good so far so good so let's do this uh, right from this side go ahead and grab a redstone torch redstone torch is gonna go right here we are also going to Grab our redstone dust. Did I put it on the floor here before? I didn't, I knew I didn't. I was like, don't do that. So take this, take this, take this. All of it goes up. Uh, once this guy's up, we're gonna want to put a redstone torch right here with a block on top. Then what we're gonna do is do the exact same thing again. I'm gonna just verify that we're doing this right, yes. Okay, so we're gonna skip the bottom one, skip the bottom torch. 
skip this guy just put the solid block right there then we're gonna do the torch torch like this block right here torch like this like that perfect grab your block of choice throw it right on top of this guy then we're gonna grab a sticky icky right here the other sticky is actually gonna go right on top of this dust see what we got going here purple door it's right here is right here basically we're just carrying this signal around more or less uh, now that we've done this we could just go ahead and take a placeholder block up like this go down grab this guy right here put this guy upside down I think they're hammering outside my house and this is gonna be the next one so now we just got to basically bring this signal up like this and the way that you do it is by putting a redstone dust right here that redstone dust is gonna want to block right across from this guy right here with a torch and a redstone dust and then we're going to put our last but not least sticky icky right here but the power's not going yet don't worry go ahead and just grab a solid block right here solid block right here redstone repeater right here two ticks delay going into a block and then on top of this block is this guy right here this is going to have the button this is if we're doing it button way i'll show you actually you know what let me show you the other way I'm gonna be a nice like that guy. So let's do this. We're gonna put this block down here. We're gonna go ahead and grab some redstone dust and put it right here. So with the lever, it should work, but it has a really awkward spot. Watch this. See how it's not, no one wants, no one wants the lever there. So uh, the easier way to run this door is to just take that out and put this block right here with a redstone torch, keeping it closed. And then you can put a button on both sides both sides of the door will work the same way and it's much easier than that so on that note let's get to the next one okay so we have a very easy and cool sand door here uh, this will work with any color powdered sand you could work a gravel any block with gravity this one's really cool too because you could move this button around and you notice that none of the stuff breaks, which is actually really rare to find on bedrock. Uh, yeah, let's do it, guys. For this guy right here, you're gonna need six redstone dust, two sticky icky pistons, uh, light gray concrete, six of them. I guess any blocks of choice is the other way to call that. Six redstone repeaters, one redstone torch, one oak button, uh, four gravity blocks of your choice, and two regular pistons. So uh, let's just do it right here. We're going to start this guy up. Let's do it right in the same spot. Bing, bing. The reason I'm not putting this in the ground, guys, is because it goes four deep. Four deep and four long and four wide without this stuff on the end. So four deep, four long, four wide. And I'm in a three by, I have a three deep world here. So uh, that's why I can't do it. So let's go. These sticky ickies are here with regular egulars and four gravity blocks that's the that's the easiest way to do it let's go ahead and grab redstone repeaters right here right here right here right here i'm just going to double check my timing is going to be four on the outside zeros on the middle so four on the outside hey tony what's up and put blocks here perfect we could just do this right on the ground here dust dust this guy here tony don't do it bro don't do it we're gonna leave this torch off just for now actually you know what we could go ahead and throw this torch on bang so once we do this that looks pretty good now we just got to carry this signal up and the way that we're gonna do this is by right here right here right here right here and right here no right there perfect so grab the redstone repeaters these ones are gonna have a two tick if I remember correctly two ticks two ticks right here two ticks right here two ticks redstone dust carrying it all the way over and you're good the door is now officially closed as you can see this would be uh something like this would be the ground and uh yeah it's kind of hipstery i think you could easily move that button uh if you desire let's go ahead and put a button right here i guess you could just even put it right there for all that matters and there you go you could even really easily put this button to be just right here on the side and open from both sides so on that note let's go to the next one okay so now we're on this uh, next little spiral jobber right here very simple very easy uh, not too classy you know it doesn't actually spiral it all goes out at one time but uh, yeah still one wide more or less pretty simple guys four blocks of choice for the door 11 other blocks of choice one half slab 13 redstone dust one levers 
four sticky ickies and a repeater I, I knew you're gonna just follow me and bother me and oh my gosh so uh, let's start this guy off this is an easy one kind of an easy one and uh, we're gonna start in the ground like this three deep over here two deep one deep and that's the way it goes uh, so let's start with our redstone dust redstone dust goes all the way up here uh, let's just go ahead and switch this I'm feeling a little OCD so once this is done go ahead and grab your sticky ickies sticky icky right here that's going to be part of your door and seal it up so uh, once we've done this you can see it's very simple we're just taking our redstone dust all the way up so nothing can stop me I'm all the way up I had to do it I had to do it we're gonna add one more block right here uh, let's go ahead and cut this guy off just for now to do this take your redstone take your slab like this then grab your block of choice. We're going to do zigzags, zigzags like this. Get rid of both of these guys. Once we're up here, zigzag again. Then we're going to actually double zigzag back. These are all not real words. I guess zigzag is a real word. Do this. And guess what we're going to do? Just go ahead and put dust all the way over this whole thing. You've literally, this is literally the whole 2x2 two two is powered by more or less this one source. So let's go down here and start with sticky piston right here. That's going to be a door. Sticky piston right here. That's going to be a door. Sticky piston right there. That's going to be a door. And we're good. So right here basically is your input. So let's do this. One, two, one, two. Grab yourself a redstone repeater. Redstone repeater into this guy with the dust right here. Put a block right here. Put your lever on it and... Bang, you have yourself a nice easy spiral door. It's hard to see at that moment, but I mean, first of all, we're going to cover this up right here. Let's do this. Let's do this. You can see the actual door take its shape once you do this. Get out of here, Tony. And there you go. Perfect. Let's do the next one. And here we go to the flush one, guys. This is kind of like bedrock's uh bedrock's uh, answer to the jeb door because you can see it sits flush if all these were yellow blocks you wouldn't even be able to tell and it looks really cool so uh let's get into this it's actually very straightforward it looks like the biggest one but it's actually pretty easy you're gonna need four blocks for the door eight sticky ickies 23 redstone dust one lever uh six redstone repeaters and 22 other blocks of choice so the way that this one i just i'm gonna just do it this way actually so Let's just make the front of the door here because this kind of gets confusing for me if we don't do it this way. So then once we do this, we want to make sure that one block behind. So let's do this with two on each side. This is going to be where your door is. Grab yourself your sticky icky. So what we're doing is kind of like the old school Jeb doors, except we're just doing the top. So do this guy right here, this guy right here just like this and then do this guy right here and this guy right here we're also going to be putting other ones here but let's just keep going on this trail so once these sticky ickies are here you can see where's my lever bang let me open this open this door up you can see we just pretty much put two more solids on the bottom here so let's just keep this going here so two more solids on the bottom i put it too far on this side here so two more solids on the bottom sticky back sticky back yellow yellow because those are door blocks so now we're just going to get this guy here set up to put out two like this sticky sticky door door so our four door blocks are now existent in the game uh, if that makes you feel any better let's grab some other solid blocks here we're going to go solid block behind all of these guys one two we're going to grab a redstone repeater what we are going to do is make sure that we use three ticks three ticks on all of them one two right here three ticks delay do this guy here bang three ticks delay and yeah so let's keep going once we've done this we're going to want to just put let's just put the front on the door right here because that'll help us out and then go one two three four five six Sounds good to me. We're going to go along the backside. So first of all, what you want to do is go behind this guy. Tony, Tony, why you been bothering me all day? So once this guy goes up, go like this and up again, go like this and up again, and then carry it over. Very simple, very easy. Let's do that. Let's copy copper cat right here, right here, up one. Right here. Up one so that looks good we're gonna need these repeaters because these repeaters are going to stop 
these repeaters are going to stop these things from hitting. Basically, we can't power this one right here, so we have to put repeater here, two ticks delay, second one on the end, repeater here, two ticks delay, because we can't power that block. Uh, once we've done this, you could go ahead and wherever side your lever is going to be, put this dust, fill all the rest of this in, just like this, this, all the way down and here and we're not quite done yet almost done though and then once you go to the front here basically let's just go down we're gonna take this guy out for now take this guy out for now and then if you see right here watch this that's your that's your first piston so right here right here right here you're gonna put a block right here so you're gonna have to bust this guy out make sure it gets up there good it doesn't get cut off right here door bang all the way let's do the same thing to the other side dust dust sticky get rid of this guy block block dust dust and bang oh guys so what we have here is a completed door you can see the door works perfectly smooth and awesome and here we are guys at the final door it actually looks like the smallest because it's kind of hipster but it uses slime blocks so uh, you might not be totally in love with it and sometimes guys it does it doesn't always but it does if you sit here I, f I flick it you know 100 times and one out of every 50 to 100 it sometimes gets jacked up in the middle I don't know it's a thing but it won't do it while I show you so let's just tell you what you need it's a very easy build guys you're gonna need two sticky ickies one obsidian uh, one redstone repeater four redstone dust a lever six blocks of choice four for the door four slime blocks and leaves are pretty handy I'll show you why after um, so let's do this guys so first things first let's just you want to go out three deep so just make yourself a nine we're just gonna make ourselves three by three three deep just because there's a lot of slime blocks here and we want to make sure uh, that nothing triggers them so uh, let's go down here we're gonna go ahead and put slime block slime block and then let's get rid of this and this right here slime block slime block right here one two three four slime blocks I'm making sure that everything's hunky dory perfect for slime blocks like this no blocks next to it uh, and then what we want to do is I had a brain fart there what are you so basically sticky sticky they both work just fine so let's go into the back of it we're gonna grab solid block right here then what we want is a obsidian block right here and then a block right here we're gonna grab our redstone dust this redstone dust is going to use a repeater. We're going to double check our delay. Make sure I'm not uh, slack in here. Two ticks delay with some redstone dust. This guy here, right here. So at the moment, this should work. I'm pretty sure it's that easy, guys. I'm not even joking. And then just put your door on the face right here. And then that way. See, it, it jams up sometimes when you right when you do it, but... You can see it works perfect right there. And then another thing that's easy is you can cut off the signal with the leaves right here. And uh, yeah, these don't move with the slime blocks and uh, you could just make yourself a door frame right here. I'm glad that this is Wild West with animals everywhere. But uh, yeah, this guy is here, done, done and done. You have yourself a nice two by two door. Works beautiful. Guys, thanks so much for tuning in to my six awesome doors. If there's six of anything else you guys want to do, uh, let me know. I've done a few Halloween decorations, cars, but this one was a little longer with the six uh, two by two doors. So, yeah, man, smash the like before you go. Subscribe, and I'll catch you on the next one.